If you've been wondering how to do dropshipping on Timu, in this video I will show you how to do that. Browsing through Timu, you find lots of great products to choose from, but if you're focusing on dropshipping, you want to take a look at the new arrival, bestsellers, and top rated tabs at the top of the page to find awesome products. You can also check out bluena.com for a list of trending dropshipping products to promote as a seller. Now, it's important to note that dropshipping on Timu goes against the Timu's uh, terms and conditions. If you are found out, you may be banned from the platform or worse, your products may not be delivered. So you want to thread carefully. In this video, I'll show you how to go about doing dropshipping on Timo the right way using two methods. Hi guys, Precious here. Welcome back to the channel. This video is part of my dropshipping on a budget series that I just started. In this series, I'll be covering everything you need to know about how to start doing dropshipping without spending a fortune. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you find this video helpful. This will help others find this video and also help me and the channel a ton to many times in advance. If you're looking to start dropshipping and need a website like this one, check out leonard.com for our ready-made website that come with hundreds of products. You can also type 500 visitors per day to your dropshipping website for as low as $30. Link in the description. Another drawback with Timo is that they ship with their own packaging, so you can simply do dropshipping directly with them as it doesn't allow for branding. <laughs> to get started, you need to find a great product. In the dropshipping on a budget series that I mentioned earlier, you'll find this video where I covered how to find products that will sell easily since we are working on a shoestring budget. Make sure to check out that video for more details. As an example, I'll use this product. To get a sense of how popular a product is, you can do a Bing search to see what platforms are selling the item you want to ship. To do this on the Edge browser, simply right click and select the Google search option. Another thing you can do is to copy the product's title and paste it on Amazon to see how many sales have been made in the past month for that product. Lastly, you can also check out Facebook's ad library to see if a page is running an ad for that product. Now that we've settled on a product that can do really well, it's time to look at how to do the actual dropshipping. As I mentioned earlier, there are two methods. The first method uh, is a manual method. Because Timu doesn't support dropshipping directly like AliExpress, we will have to use a workaround. To pull this off, we first need a tool to help us get the work done. The tool we need is the AliExpress Search by Image Chrome extension. It's free, so you can install it. This extension allows um, us to do an image product search on AliExpress. I'll talk about this shortly. Now that we have the extension installed, the next thing is to do an image search of the product on AliExpress. You can do this by right clicking on the product image on Timo. Select the option that says search goods on AliExpress by this image. On the list page, sort by price to find the cheapest option. Once you find it, you want to import it to your website. Now, this video is not about how to import products, but I'm working on a video that will show you how to import dropshipping products into your WooCommerce or Shopify store. So make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss a bit. In this example, I will import this product to one of our ready-made websites. A ready-made website are built with WordPress and WooCommerce. If you are using a particular platform, you can import to that platform directly. The second method supports both Shopify and WooCommerce, so I'll cover that uh, later in the video. At the back end of our ready-made website, you can then do further edits if you need to and then publish the product so it can be available at the front end. I recommend that you take the time to write your product descriptions the right way so you can take advantage of organic Google traffic from Google. Since the focus of this video is doing dropshipping on a budget. Now before we proceed, in this video I covered how to write product descriptions that actually rank on Google and drive traffic. So make sure to check that out. Now it's important to know that I've already set my price markup at the back end, so this is taken into account when the product is being imported to my website. Here we can see the product is live. If you compare the product description on Timo and on the AliExpress uh, page, we can see that my product description is very, very well written. If you simply import the product text from AliExpress, you have less than 1% chance of ranking on Google or even getting any meaningful traffic. At the top here, you can see that the product description has a specs table and below it, you can see that there's also a quiz or product advisor designed to help the customer decide if they actually need this product. And also, 
what the product is good for. This is strategic as it allows us to build our email list and own the customer. At the end of the quiz, the customer is asked to enter the email address before the results are shown. You can see that the product images have alt text that tell Google what this product is about. It also includes keywords I've researched on Google. These keywords were also used to write the product description and can be found in the rest of the content. You can also see that my product description links to other articles that I've written on about this product to establish my website as an authority around the topic of this product. Check the link in the description to watch the video where I showed how to write a better description. You can also download the prompts that I use to generate this type of product description for free. You'll find all the links in the description. The second method involves using a service called AutoDS. AutoDS is an all-in-one dropshipping solution that helps you automate your dropshipping journey. You can find top dropshipping products and explore private suppliers. AutoDS can be integrated into our ready-made website, which I built with WordPress and WooCommerce. It also has an integration with Shopify. However, it requires a subscription. The reason why I'm recommending this is because it has a direct support for Timo. You can import Timo products directly into your account and then push them to your Shopify or WooCommerce store. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do a separate video on AutoDS and how to import products step by step on Shopify and WooCommerce. AutoDS provides a 14 day free trial for just $1, but if you use my affiliate link in the description, you'll get a one more trial instead of the regular 14 days that everyone else gets. Hope you found this video helpful. Make sure to leave a comment, like, and subscribe this really helps me uh, continue doing what i'm doing thanks very much for your time see you on the next one